Okay, April 1st, 2022. Uh, temperatures are going to get up into the 50s today. However, it's going to be a very windy day. Winds are going to build by the hour. Um, so we're getting started here at 7 o'clock. Had uh, some severe weather yesterday. High winds, thunderstorms. Looks like the creeks could produce uh, some dirty water here early today. So that's going to change the game plan a little bit, but we'll see what we can do. i uh, got Robert and Wayne coming today from the Philly area. We'll keep you posted. All right, Wayne's got the first one in the net, and it's a nice one. Good, Good way job. to start the morning. Bob's doing it again. Is that a pretty good hit that time? I, I, I was looking back and I saw your rod go. Oh, well, that's another big one, bud. Nice. Woo! That's another three pounder. Bob, you switch sides. Yeah. It's a tube. He's got a little, yeah. little blotchy bass syndrome going there. What do you got, Wayne? I don't know. I don't know. Not bad. They're not all going to be three pounds, Wayne. <laughs> I know you started that way. It doesn't come out again. <laughs> On that. There's the mink. He's not bad. <laughs> Another chunker. Yeah, he's bigger than I thought. Man, he hit it as soon as it hit that water. I thought it was a stick. I know. I know, as soon as I took the slack out. Felt him. Okay, don't let him rub on the bottom of the boat. Good job. Another quality fish. Great job, Bob. That's a good one. Wait, you see how close he was? Yeah, I was surprised at that. Oh, chunky. We got him. All right. All quality fish today so yeah, far. Yeah, they have been. Oh, look how fat it is. Man, he's really got blotchy blast. He's got, he's all confused. That is a, he is a look at that fish. <laughs> Holy cow. Three eagles here together. Oh yeah. Oh, good one, Bob. Wow. Yeah. That might be the longest of the day. Keep that happening. All right. Nice Another nice fish. Thank you, Lord. Big fish day. Okay, getting ready to start day two with uh, Bob and Wayne. We are starting at 8.30 because of the cold from last night. Uh, yesterday's trip, difficult wind, hard to control the boat, but the guys battled through it. They had 21 quality smallies and uh, one fall fish. So we'll see what the Lord has for us today. Finally get the camera out here. We got a few in the boat, not many. It's a tough day for us here. Let's... Water went muddy on us and we're struggling. Oh, Bob just landed a 19 and a half and now he's got another nice fish coming in, I think. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's another decent fish. He's fishing the Shamu bucktail jig. Nice. Thank you, Lord, that's another quality fish. Another quality fish. Got him. Look at that one. Oh, smaller one. Oh, that's a small one of the trip, I think. Okay, wrapping up the video. Um, 
Day number two was a grind. Um, the river was muddy all the way across. We ran from Fort Hunter all the way north of Amity Hall in the Juniata. The only clear water we found was Blow Carks Creek, and we did catch two of our ten there. Uh, really had to have a precise cast, tight to the bank. Again, the uh, uh, fit cold water hairs delight was probably the best bait. Uh, followed by snagger tubes, um, but we kit, did catch a Bob got a 19 and a half inch, four and a half pound, 4.5 pound um, smallie angler ward fish, and he got that on the Shamu uh, bucktail jig. So tough day, but <laughs> the boys fought hard, and we we got some fish in the boat.